brothers and sisters, welcome. We know when they put it off when you when you fall. And I call upon your honor of one. No honor of the Indians and the honor of the Indians. This is our conference for 2024 and next year. And, uh, first week in February, they will be confirmed. So, again, basically say it's their last day to do It's Sunday school children. So, from next year onwards, of, or from after this, they will be young people. Now, we begin with this new street. Without further ado, I'm going to call on Sister Bordeaux. Then representing the senior members. Say again. Hmm? Hello. Mr. Long. Mr. Long. Okay, the change there. Mr. the Long was asked to stay at the for Sister Bordeaux. Come and stay at the board. That's all we have of the senior members. Thank you. Morning, brothers and sisters. Never get a good thing. Yes, you have to wait for CD. Yeah, I was asked in the week to say a few words. I was then asked, I did ask how many minutes. I won't say how many minutes, otherwise, I'm going to feel like a, a noodle. But firstly, I'm thankful that I could have been part of the confirmings. I could be, I could be part of their lives. And I know them, the three of them, they are always close together, especially when they're in the divine service, whenever they're in the confirmation clause. They always sit together, they chat their things. Yes, I'm aware of the circumstances each and every one of them have to go through, have to go through. But I read something, let not your circumstances determine your future. Not your circumstances. What you have got, what goals you have in life, go for us. Reach for the sky. I told you to read it. Reach for the sky. So, I thought of what's Lano? 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 Yeah, I thought of him. You know what? I feel proud of him. I've never ever seen a choir master conduct for a congregation like Rosedale, upstairs and downstairs. For the service, for the confirmance, he conducted the whole congregation. I've never seen a conductor. Yes, I've seen it in Tarpasa, but here yeah, I've seen it for the first time. Today I want to say to him, carry on, choir masters, mark the break. Mark the break on the young man. And sometimes we, on, we ought to be blamed for not encouraging our children to go forward. We as parents, we as ministers, we as leaders. It makes me also so when I look to the, if I go back, please, I'm asking you, please, carry on. The bond we should got amongst one another here, let it grow. I know you always speak about school, and you speak about this, you speak about that. But you will be going into another phrase. You will be going into another. I'll tell you the same. Now you will be, you will be coming. Please, do not throw slip. Do not throw slip. I know you. Do not throw slip. What we burn, the service will confirm us. Seek ye first the kingdom of God. Please, seek the Lord, even in your schoolwork, even in your level, because you will be making a promise. Just remember, the promise won't be made to the servant who will confirm you. The promise won't be made to the congregation. You will have to carry that promise out. I renounce Satan in all his works. Satan comes every time. He comes to me also. He said on my shoulder too. Now he tells me also what he tried. So please, by your confirmation, remain faithful and stick to your vow. Remain faithful to your parents. 
Remain faithful to your parents. Remain faithful to each and every servant, each and every member here. Remain faithful to God above all, God of Heavenly Father. Dear parents, you will still have to guide your children. Dear youth leaders, particularly I speak to you also. Let the driving force happen. It's not happening. Please, let us not let, let our children please, beloved brothers and sisters. And I say to you, remain faithful in the Lord. And may God bless you abundantly, naturally, and most spiritually. Above all, remain faithful to you. God of Heavenly Father, remain faithful to your parents. Remain faithful to your guardians, those who have to take care of you. Remain faithful to them. As always say, thank you for what they have brought it unto you. Thank you very much, beloved brothers and sisters. Amen. <laughs> Like the retired lady said, now this is a very special home. This is our home that we together, not just in the spiritual world in our life, but also in the natural schools. Um, so they are always close to him. First, we are going to thank our Heavenly Father and the lives of these five families. And also, we continue to walk them in their life, in the spiritual as well as in the natural lives. On the day in fact, we have a great one. I saw you guys were going to be into the you guys met in the school to walk into the same. But the second is you guys know the church, you just want to join from the natural country that you guys have. You guys don't see the church and what single things are needed. For this group, tears and laughter were shared together. They had many facts where they had to act one another. And when they had to embrace each other to whatever it was called in it. Today, we have here to celebrate the Sunday school channel with guys. So, please, we will be taking the next step in the race in the young people. No longer you will control our Sunday school channel, but you will be part of the young people. We will make a vow to God and will take the responsibility and respect of the problem for yourself in your spiritual way. My message today to you guys is Jeremiah 1 verse 7. Being says, yeah. You are not young, you are not too young in wonders and explain to you. You have been chosen before you were born, who is wrong and who is Also, they should not take any risks by taking by taking with them life. There will be a lot of challenges. But taking to God, you grew and all that is important. He said one friend that will always have a back. They will be by the side, doesn't matter what. Thank you to our wild mess, make our Life's experience easy to teach to each other. They are no longer here to them. They are divine, they are the guide of angels. Each of them are the guide of angels. It's looking over you and it says, I am proud of that child. That is my prayer. Thank you.
future bright, a faith to hold, with promises sealed in grace and light. Step ahead, your spirit's bright. From waters pure where life began, God's love embraced you to perform his plan. Now strengthened by his words so true, a mission set a path for you. Each prayer you've whispered, every dream, God's love has woven through each seed. Through Charles' faith and joys you'll find, his spirit guides your heart and mind. In every moment, you trust his care. With faith, hope, love, his gifts you bear. A beacon strong for all to see. A life in Christ, a soul set free. Stand firm, dear youth, with courage deep. In God's own hand, your soul he'll keep. New, new journeys call, adventures near. But Christ's own love is always here. So walk with joy. His purpose clear, His grace, your strength, His voice, your cheer. With hearts of your your faith will shine, beloved child, forever divine.
in the world must be a grateful for the sacrifice you have made to ensure our spiritual health and health. To our brothers and sisters in the congregation, we appreciate, we appreciate your warmth and kindness and fellowship. Your presence in our lives and enrich our faith journey, and we look forward to continuing to grow and serve you. And to our senior members, we honor your wisdom, experience, and dedication to our congregation. Your example of faith inspires us to be more committed to our spiritual journey. In closing, may God bless us and continue to guide us as we all strive to serve and pray for you. Thank you. Thank you, dear King Thomas. You can remain here in front. I call on the director to come and then over the certificates and the gifts. Yes.